I've heard it said before, you can always come home to the hall. There's just something special about 400 South Orange Avenue that you discover once you step inside the gates of Mother Seton's home. That something stays with you even beyond your time at this place. It's a feeling, a reminder that this is home. It's a place that reflects the state of New Jersey, a blue collar place, a place where toughness and grit make possibility become a reality. It's a place where leaders are born and where champions rise. And it's in that rise that for the greats, they never forget where they came from. That is the case today. Your donations and your support has really opened the door for us so that we can be the best professionals, the best academics, and the best people that we could possibly be. For me, my legacy story actually starts with someone from my own generation, which is my older sister. Uh, when I was in sixth grade, uh, my sister brought me during spring break to Seton Hall to attend some classes with her. My first Seton Hall memory that I actually seriously remember, I was two years old and my mom was getting her doctorate and I remember talking to the St. Patrick statue. And I was just telling him about my day. I was like, I had such a great day today, Patrick. How about you? And that's my first Seton Hall memory. And I think it's so crazy that I pass that statue every day to class. The Many Are One event involves students, family members, administrators, uh, faculty, and regents and donors and the commitment to making sure we have an endowed fund comes from the Many Are One event. Affording college can be tough, but the alumni scholarship, what it really has done is it, it has allowed me to focus more on my academics and getting involved with my community rather than you know having to find other means of funding my academic journey. We don't stop with giving out the scholarship. The scholarships are very important in supporting their, them financially, but we also maintain a level of connection so that we can support them and in, this, in their success in their studies. If I could talk to the donors, I would give them a hug. But I would say thank you and give them the biggest hug I could because I'm more than thankful. This year, we were able to give the largest number of scholarships to the legacy student applicants. And it's largely because of the generosity of people like you who are in the room. They have really helped me live out the optimal Seton Hall journey that I, I have uh, wanted to and dreamed of since I came with my sister all those years ago. But your financial support is critically important to making this happen. Thank you so much for all that you do. Welcome to the 36th Annual Many Are One Alumni Awards Gala. I now introduce your MC for the evening, Fox News reporter, host and commentator, Class of 2017 member, and proud pirate, Mr. John Fanta.